Hi, and welcome to the Focus on Eye Health Expert Series. I'm Jeff Todd, CEO at Prevent Blindness. Today, we'll be talking about diabetes-related eye disease with Dr. Kristen Wanyawu, Associate Professor of Ophthalmology and Visual Science at the Yale University School of Medicine. Thank you so much for being with us. Thanks. It's awesome to be here. It's a nice opportunity to be with Prevent Blindness and to be able to participate in the awesome work that you all do. Yeah. Can you talk a little bit um, generally about how vision loss appears within people with diabetes and what changes in their vision they may notice? Yeah, so this is the hard part. So there are a lot of patients that don't have any vision changes and they will have advanced disease that we see in their eye and still be 2020, no problem. Which is why our screening systems really have to be elegant and refined to try to help find people. Because we know that if we find disease early enough, we can intervene and we can keep people from going blind. But when our patients do have symptoms, they may notice a little floater. Sometimes that can be um, some blood in the eye, kind of a, it'll be like a swash of floaters. Sometimes people will have a red streak or a brown streak that they experience that could be bleeding in the eye. Um, but diabetes actually manifests itself in lots of different ways in the eye. So our patients with diabetes have cataracts sooner. They also have more dryness in the eye because of the same inflammatory changes that cause nerve damage here, also cause nerve damage in the eye. Um, also with eye pressure issues, sometimes those abnormal vessels show up in the drainage system of the eye as well. So sometimes you can have that, but a lot of it doesn't have any symptoms, which is why getting screening is really important. But when you do have symptoms, sometimes people can also have central vision changes. So sometimes our patients will say, I used to be able to read this. And even if I put my reading glasses on, I can't quite see like right in the center. And sometimes that is that swelling that we talked about when the vessels don't quite hold the blood in like they should, and they start leaking out, and usually it's in the middle of the, the vision. So those are some of the things that you may notice. But if you have a diagnosis of diabetes, you need to just make sure that you have regular screening evaluations, because sometimes you don't even notice anything. Thank you so much, Dr. Wan Yawu. I really enjoyed these conversations with you and just look forward to having more in the future.